Vicki, we've covered at least 26 freeway shootings since the start of this year alone. Take a look. Most of them happened on two freeways running through Oakland, Interstates 580 and 880. At least eight shootings happened on each so far this year. CHP reporting a total of 35 fatal freeway shootings in the Bay Area between 2020 and this year, with 10 happening on I-580 in Alameda County, making that roadway the deadliest in the state for freeway shootings. Back in April, we covered the tragic killing of young Eliana Chrysostomo on 880. She died in Fremont after a stray bullet from a gunfight pierced her heart. Her family was headed to a birthday dinner in Milpitas. Police arrested three alleged gang members in that case. Meantime, we're learning the Sacramento woman charged with firing a gun last week on I-80 near the Bay Bridge Toll Plaza was allegedly driving recklessly in the area before the incident. She's due back in court on Friday and is being held without bail. She faces up to 22 years in prison. Well, as for solutions to this ongoing problem, many are clamoring for more freeway cameras, saying surveillance could help catch more of the people who commit these crimes. Governor Gavin Newsom has said that cameras will be installed along 880 and 580 at some point this year. Another possible solution officials are looking at? More highway patrol officers. But CHP faces a staffing shortage, and we take a look at what's being done to address that coming up at 5.30. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Stephanie Lynn. Dan and Vicki, back to you. All right, thank you, Steph.